Before connecting the patient, we recommend performing a system check to ensure the device is fully functional. The checklist for the system check is contained in the Carina instructions for use. The system check is fast and easy to perform and takes as little as five minutes. The check includes the following steps. Make sure that all the necessary equipment is connected correctly, including the high-pressure oxygen hose, power cable, HEPA filter, bacterial filter. To switch Carina on, please push the power switch on the back of the device. When starting up, an alarm will sound briefly and the LEDs will light up. After Carina performs a short internal self-test, the device proceeds to standby mode. The screen provides certain information right away. Please check the status line to verify the correct valve type, leak or expiratory valve, is displayed. If not, change the valve or contact trained personnel to change the selection switch on the bottom of Carina. Please check the patient connection mode in the status line. It can be set to mask or tube. If it doesn't correspond to the used type, please make the necessary changes. Connect the test lung to the patient circuit. Now set the mode, PC BiPAP. In the US, this mode is called PCSIMV. To do this, press the button below the set mode and turn the rotary knob until you see PC BiPAP. Then press the rotary knob to confirm your choice. All other changes can be quickly made by following the selection procedure. Press the button, turn the rotary knob and confirm selection by pressing the rotary knob. For this mode, please select the following settings. Post end expiratory pressure, 5 millibars. Inspiratory pressure, 15 millibars. FiO2, 21%. Frequency, 10 breaths per minute. I to E ratio, 1 to 2. Ramp, 0 0.2 seconds. To set the alarm limits, please press the button Select Menu, then press the button Alarms and set the alarm limits. Airway pressure high to 20 millibars. T disconnect, 0 seconds. Please press the Start Standby button. Ventilation will now begin. Please compress the test lung. Each time it's compressed, expiration is possible. We call this free breathing. If the patient wishes to exhale, this is possible. This functionality is available for every mode of ventilation. Please compress the test lung several times during the upper pressure level. After a few seconds of compressions, you will hear an alarm signal and the message airway pressure high will appear. Please confirm the alarm by using the rotary knob. Disconnect the test lung from the hose system. Immediately, an alarm tone will be activated and the alarm message airway pressure low will appear. Please reconnect the test lung following the activation of the alarm. Please change ventilation settings to Spawn CPAP, Settings Apnea Ventilation On, Alarm T Apnea 5 seconds. The Alarm T Apnea allows the user to determine the apnea alarm time and the apnea ventilation start time. Now mimic a spontaneously breathing patient by pressing the test lung. When you stop spontaneous breathing, the alarm apnea ventilation will appear after 5 seconds and the apnea ventilation will begin. Now please disconnect Carina from the external power supply. The alarm external power failure is activated. Next switch Carina to the standby mode. 
You have now successfully completed the Carina system check. Carina is now ready to comfortably ventilate your patient. Thank you.